So in my last videos of this mouse, you probably have noticed this horrendous clipping with the <laughs> with the sombrero on the, the ears. So I've taken time to to make this specific code that the ears no longer go through the sombrero. I'm pressing the the testing button here, so I, you can see this is with the script on and this is <laughs> with the script off. Basically, there, yeah, that, that's it off. It shouldn't be clipping, but I guess I can't get any. See, it shouldn't be clipping. I, I don't know. I guess if I paused it, it made some kind of difference. Anyways, yeah, normally it doesn't clip. I don't know. Just paused it at the wrong time, I guess. So, yeah, this is something now. So this is what it looks like now to be a little a little Mexican sombrero wearing mouse <laughs> with the ears now no longer clipping through it. Here's the comparison again without the the specific line of code that, that moves the ears down when you wear the sombrero and and here with with them. So for anyone who has this this type of gaming O C D now you can I mean, video OCD, any kind of OCD, you now you can rest assured that the clipping is much rarer now. <laughs> with the sombrero at least. And with the cowboy hat it wasn't an issue yet. Or ever. Because it's got this basic shape. So yeah. <laughs> Many, many things go into making a game. And this is one possible such thing. <laughs> Nesta would probably want me... Nesta did ask me at one point to do cloth physics on, on things. I'm not sure if I'll ever get around to, to making cloth physics on, on sombreros and any cloaks and whatever. Probably not too soon, but this is something that was bothering me, so I, I made these ears lower. <laughs> Enjoy ears that don't clip. Goodbye. Subscribe.